This is Suzanne Keating with your Astro Weekly Forecast for December 30th, 2019 through January 5th, 2020. On Monday, December 30th, a void of course Aquarius moon makes it hard to motivate early this morning. Then the moon enters impressionable Pisces at 10.41 a.m. and nostalgia creeps in. The Sun and Jupiter join forces to have us take a serious look at what it is we want to be recognized for. Use Jupiter's optimistic outlook to expand your horizons and educate yourself on the steps you need to take to build a solid foundation for the future. Communication and connection is the key to a productive day. On Tuesday, December 31st, we end 2019 under the sensitive Pisces moon, which can lend itself well to compassion, artistic expressions, or meditative pursuits. However, Pisces is also the realm of illusion, drugs, and negativity. Know your own shadow side and avoid sliding into 2020 in a depressed state of mind. On Wednesday, January 1st, 2020, here it is folks, Happy New Year, and welcome to the start of an exciting one. The moon in Pisces interacts with Mars in Scorpio, motivating us to be assertive and take some action on whatever it is that we're deeply invested in. A brief void of course moon phase tonight from 9.13 to 11 p.m. is a good time to center ourselves and review our intentions. The moon enters Aries at 11 p.m. On Thursday, January 2nd, 2020, the Aries moon today says it's time to put your self-confidence to use and get busy. Just know that your feelings aren't in line with your thoughts at this first quarter moon, so you'll need to compromise on how much you can do today. Are there blocks in your way that need taking care of first? Finish up any loose ends before jumping ahead. And remember, we are in between an eclipse cycle that began at the new moon solar eclipse, an industrious Capricorn on December 26th, and the full moon lunar eclipse that's going to occur in emotional cancer on January 10th. On Friday, January 3rd, it's an Aries moon day with Mars now in fiery Sagittarius for the next month and a half. This is explorer energy. It has us seeking new horizons and broadening our knowledge base, as well as our field of vision. Mars makes a harmonious alignment to the healer Chiron for helping ourselves and others through our process of becoming whole. There's a deep well of enthusiasm available to all seekers now. On Saturday, January 4th, the moon doesn't become active until it enters resourceful Taurus at 11.15 a.m. where she's said to be exalted in this nature-loving sign. Taurus desires stability and seeks financial security and well-being. Aligned with the planet Uranus, there's an air of instability today that has us wanting to hang on to what we have and protect our interest. Enjoy the simple pleasures life has to offer. On Sunday, January 5th, see if you can really enjoy this Taurus moon day as a gift from the universe. Take a walk outside with mother nature, then kick back, settle in and enjoy the company of loved ones. No matter what urges you may feel to disrupt the peacefulness of this rare day, either by stubbornly wanting your own way, or not being able to share lovingly, or by playing the devil's advocate and wanting to stir the pot, don't do it. Be appreciative instead. And until next time, this is Suzanne Keating saying, remember to keep your head in the stars and your feet on the ground.